Um, with my dad, we mostly see him at weddings, funerals, and then sometimes a few other events here and there. Um, but yeah, it's complicated. Like we have kind of just had to make our own decisions and um, realize that you can't change people. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is enjoying their day. And I wanted to talk a little bit about the Duggar family, specifically Jill and Derek. We all know that that's Jim, Bob, and Michelle's daughter. And she has been going through a lot these last couple of months, even years, should I say. We all know that Jill released a book, Counting the Cost, which really made headlines all over the world because she really kind of exposed her dad and the religious cult that she was raised in. However, for unfortunate circumstances, the family is reuniting for the first time in a while. Everyone in one room, in one setting, to honor their late daughter who unfortunately passed away. On April 13th, Jill announced that her daughter, Isla Marie Dillard, she did not make it. It was very unfortunate because Jill did have a miscarriage before she had her most recent son, Freddie. So heartbreak is something that she's way too familiar with. And actually a lot of the Duggar family members have went through some sort of heartbreak, including miscarriages or stillbirths. We know Joy, she had a stillbirth as well. The family has been divided and we all know not everybody and Anybody's family is just going to get along. But with this particular family, it was, they were always like the picture perfect family until the whole Josh Duggar scandal. After the Josh Duggar scandal, everybody kind of wanted to expose what was really happening behind closed doors, including a documentary called Shiny Happy People and even Jill writing in her book some of the type of things that she had to go through. They held a nice ceremony for her daughter and all the family attended. The only person I did not see was Anna, Josh's wife, and her kids. And it may be that Anna is now living elsewhere and was not able to make it. I don't know the details, but from the pictures that I'm showing, it looked like it was a nice peaceful peaceful farewell they had pink balloons they had it set up really nicely and they also had um, obituary for her I'm pretty sure a lot of the family members put their issues aside to be there for Jill and to honor her even her dad was there which is not a surprise because Jim Bob really he has an ego so he's not gonna not show up for people to say oh he didn't show up you know because jill would invite him you know just something like this they put their issues aside and be there for family but jim bob was there and i know it was probably very uncomfortable but at that moment i'm pretty sure that was the last thing jill and derek was thinking about was their issues with jim bob and this is actually a step forward in the right direction to maybe having that relationship again but i know in jill's word she said it's going to take some time some time it's not something that's going to happen overnight but it was a really beautiful ceremony. Some faces I haven't seen in a while, like Joseph and his wife, Kendra, and her four kids. Um, also seeing Josiah there and his wife and his kids. I mean, it was like a little reunion and it was actually good to see. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe so you won't miss any updates. Bye for now.